Beautiful day. Yeah, good morning, our dear guests here and also in the virtual world. We are live streaming today, so the other in the virtual world can also enjoy this special moment. I'm Majid Dway. I'm the Dean of the College of Agriculture. We are honored today to have our Lincoln University interim president, Dr. John D. Mosley, to deliver the opening remarks. Dr. Mosley joined Lincoln University seven years ago in 2014 as head men's basketball coach. His leadership qualities led to the additional responsibilities as the athletic director in 2015. He was named interim president of Lincoln University in May of 2015 or 2021. <laughs> His career has included 12 of his 18 years in higher education on HBCU campuses. His goal and his current position is to improve Lincoln University experience from admission to graduation, from student alums, from students to alums, and from community member to friends. Dr. Mosley, was born and raised in Warren County, North Carolina. He earned both his undergraduate and graduate degrees from East Carolina University. Dr. Mosley earned his doctorate in educational leadership and policy analysis from University of Missouri along his wife, Crystal, in May of this year. The Mosleys have a daughter, Jillian. At this moment, please join me in welcoming Dr. Mosley. Thank you. Uh, what a day. What a beautiful weather for such a special occasion as this. Uh, I am uh, very excited about the turnout this morning here in person. Uh, and I'm thankful for those that are joining us online. There's a lot of great things that take place every day at Lincoln University. And uh, certainly the, the, the College of Agriculture Extension is, is, is certainly uh, one of those shining stars at this institution. Uh, it's only been a few years ago that it was about noon time that uh, the, the place where we may now stand, uh, there was something much different and we were worried. Uh, we, we had a fire here at this very same place. And you see what coming together and working together, uh, there were a lot of ent entities that, that, that played a role in helping us get, get back. And now uh, this facility is among our best facilities uh, at Lincoln University. And something that our researchers and our students can benefit from. Uh, and as a result of that, uh, communities that they serve, and farmers all across this state, uh, and agriculture leaders all across the state, uh, will benefit from the activities that take place inside. And so, welcome. Welcome to Lincoln uh, for a fun day and a fun moment in our history. Uh, I would like to take a minute to recognize some of our guests that are here with us today. Uh, all of you are special, but there, there's a few that uh, we want to make sure we say a special thanks to, beginning with our mayor, Terry Turgeon. Thank you for being here. State Representative Travis Fitzwater, thank you, sir, for being here. Gary Palmer with the Jefferson City Chamber of Commerce. I didn't get a chance to say hello, but I want to make sure uh, Brad McCord with USDA. Are you here, Brad? Thank you. Thank you. have any other elected officials with us this morning that maybe didn't get a chance to RSVP, we'd like to, we'd like to acknowledge you. Obviously, the state, uh, the state's officials are very important with all that we do in agriculture. Uh, we continue to, uh, to fight for our, our land grant match to continue the great work that agriculture is doing that that's benefit not only the state of Missouri, but, but the United States of America. Uh, I know in the last few weeks, I've had an opportunity to be in several meetings uh, we are the state's leaders and among the nation's leaders in hemp research. 
and, and so that's uh, that, that. It completely blows my mind to think of all the different things that we can do, and how, from an agricultural crop standpoint, uh, we have an opportunity to be the leaders uh, to create the the, the, the seeds and to show farmers the best way to go about producing this crop that could benefit us in so many ways. Uh, there are other exciting things, and I don't want to go through all of them, but I can tell you, if, you, if you're from the community today, if you spend a, spend a few minutes with our researchers to let them tell you about the things that they have going on, uh, I think you'd be very surprised uh, about all the great things that are taking place. Uh, and so, at this point, uh, we'd like to, to ask that our members of the community, uh, everybody, we're here to cut this great ribbon. And so we're going to gather around. Uh, I'm sure somebody has the ribbon and those great big scissors. And, uh, and so we're going we're gonna to do that right now. So if, uh, if the members would join us up front. The Jefferson City Ambassador, the Chamber of Commerce, would join us as well. And while we're here, I I'd like to just say uh, publicly, uh, Gary and the Chamber, uh, oftentimes people in the community talk about partnering with Lincoln uh, University. Uh, Gary and the Chamber have done that. Uh, they, they have done that through an internship program that we're launching next week. Uh, and so I, I just want to publicly say thank you to the Chamber for not just talking the talk, but walking the walk uh, and saying that you want to help Lincoln University become the best that it can be. Please hold on. We're doing a post for all people with the grant purposes of the paper. When the photographer is finished, we will ask that the Jefferson City Chamber of Commerce would you mind stepping away for just a minute before the other. Are we done? Yeah, we're done. Okay. Thank you. Can we look? Step aside or where are we? We're all. The photographers can tell us what we need to do for safety in this place. The research stuff here. Yeah. Anybody that's going to be associated with the facility that's not going to be there, you guys come up. All the research. 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 Nothing that exciting. Well, thanks for taking it out of your day. So if you're tall and standing in front and somebody's standing behind you, not quite as there you go. Good. Can't see. Nobody stand behind me. <laughs> <laughs> that is correct, sir. <laughs> All right. Yep. And we're gonna fight the sun, so. Let me make a little adjustment here again. All right, I think she's ready. Uh -huh. right. It never touched the first time. Hold tight, hold tight. Hold it tight on the end. Yeah, so hold the ribbon tight. Hold the ribbon tight. Yeah, right. 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 Right